All right, right here we got my cousin's truck. It's a 2015 GMC Denali with 6.2. We're gonna test it with a draggy. We're gonna see what it'll do in zero to 60, eighth mile, quarter mile. I'll let you guys know, I'm gonna video it, and see how it goes. That's good. All right, this is the first graph, zero to 60 in two wheel drive, happening in 6.64 seconds. You can see the big spike in the orange line from when the draggy flew off the dashboard. The blue line is the speed. You can see it makes a uh, one-two shift right there around 30 miles an hour and right before 60. This is the zero to 60 graph for the four-wheel drive launch. This time I made sure the draggy didn't move. And uh, you can see the one-two shift real good. And you can also see the two-three shift right there before 60. Uh, it also did zero to 60 with in uh, 6.18 seconds with one foot of rollout. You know, that's how manufacturers test it, so that's pretty good. All right, guys, this is the quarter mile graph from the first attempt in two wheel drive. It ran a 14.69, which was pretty good. You can see that orange spike there early in the graph where the draggy flew off the dashboard. But uh, the 2.48 60 foot is pretty slow. And uh, you can note it ran a 9.58 at 77.8 in the eighth. And he also didn't run the full quarter mile. You can tell that his uh, speed didn't improve too much from the 1,000 foot to the quarter mile mark because he wasn't sure how far to go. All right, now this is the quarter mile graft from the second run in four wheel drive. He ended up running a 14.52 at 96.79 miles per hour. This was a full pull. Uh, the truck actually did really good. The zero to 60, I mean, not zero to 60, the 60 foot was 2.27 seconds, which isn't too bad on the street, even though it was four wheel drive for a bone stock truck. But if you pay attention, you can look at the eighth mile, mile per hour and tell that it's over a mile per hour slower in four wheel drive, even with a good launch. And the reason for that is parasitic drag. That tells me that if he would have started in four wheel drive and put it in two wheel drive after he started, he probably could have gotten at least a 14.4, maybe a 14.3, which would be pretty outstanding for a stock truck. 